it's Jess. How are you? Welcome to my channel. Um, today I'm going to be talking about positives in mental health. Um, there's so many negatives and we experience so many negative things and I just thought I'd focus a little bit on the positive things that we go through and stuff. So I'm just quickly going to go through, do a quick little video for you. Um, so please hang in there. Um, one thing that like I know that a lot of people experience is that we get experience in itself to help other people and to understand other people with mental health. And um, I know some people are more private. I'm pretty open and I know I've had people come to me, um, not even for advice, just for comfort and just to talk and I've just listened and stuff like that. So that is something that, um, that I experience now that is a positive and um, it's never really a hassle unless I need to take care of myself first. Um, I feel since um, I've been diagnosed with mental health issues and I've experienced all this, I feel like I have an understanding for life that I didn't have before. Um, especially now more with my spiritual side of things and stuff. Um, I definitely feel um, like I have more experience maybe in certain areas than other people and I take it and I help other people. Um, my mental health has brought me to um, becoming spiritual and becoming a spiritual being and um, learning to appreciate and love myself even though I don't sometimes um, due to my mental health, um, I have this experience of, um, spiritual growth and, um, it's been wonderful and beautiful and, um, I have so much more knowledge and a perception that I never had before and an understanding of life. <clears throat> it's brought me to be more loving and caring, um, to people. I always was a loving and caring person, but more understanding towards people even people who don't experience mental health, it's, they still experience some anxiety, some depression, some life shit. And I feel like I have just the love and care I can give to those people that is driven from my experience. And it is a positive and it's beautiful in itself. Um, it has brought me... Um, Awareness, awareness of myself, awareness of my identity, awareness of my emotions. I'm so much more aware because I need to do this to keep going forward, but I'm aware of these things and it keeps me going and it's excellent. And um, uh, a lot of people don't have the awareness for me personally that I have. Um, um, and it's cause, because I have mental illness. I need to be aware so that's what's driven me to do that and now I'm just on a like ride to just learning all about awareness and it's beautiful in itself um I appreciate growth way more than I probably did before I always did when I was younger I was a Christian and I always wanted to grow as a Christian but um I experience growth periods and I appreciate them so much and um that's part of my spiritual journey, which was from my mental illness. So um, it's just great to to have this perspective and I'm having a good day and um, I'm really grateful right now. It's really nice. Um, another thing that's happened is through being in the hospital and stuff like that, I've had the opportunity to meet um, through my mental illness just in general, really unique, cool people. People who are struggling, but they're unique and they're cool and they're beautiful. And um, their stories, I've gotten to know their stories and their struggles. And I've had this experience of learning about it um, and make friends and everything. And it's been beautiful in itself. Um, something that's happened when I was younger, not when I was younger per se, but I'd say when, um, probably about six years ago, seven years ago now, I was in a running group and I got to run and I had this experience where like I enjoyed exercise 
and I was in a running group through my outpatient care and it was a beautiful experience in itself not even because I met people but I got to get in touch with myself with exercise um, it's not something that's very uh, doable right now with my fibromyalgia but it's something I wouldn't shut the door on in the future of experiencing maybe some pain to be able to have a good run but I'm definitely not there yet um, but I I've had it I've had like through the public care here in, in um, uh, Canada I've experienced um, different groups like in different programs that help anybody like DBT like I have knowledge of DBT and like that help that program helps anybody CBT I CBT helps anybody anybody can get something out of these things and I've had opportunities to do these things and it's great um, it's nice when I'm in a good perspective that I can remember these things and not just the negatives and put the positives to work and it's beautiful and with that I'll leave you guys go please like subscribe comment and um, down below is my contact information email I'm open to any conversation um, totally open to whatever if anybody wants to contact me and today is a beautiful day and I want to thank you guys for listening and keep coming back. There'll be makeup, there'll be everyday life, there'll be um, spirituality, there'll be mental health. There's going to be a general, like a lot of stuff. So with that, I'll let you go. I love you guys.